All right, P. What do you do, my bro? BJ, what's good, man? How you feeling, man? I'm feeling wonderful. How are you today, Papa? Oh, man, we living in paradise. You know, we can't complain about much, man. The rest of the world going to be like, what's wrong with y'all, man? <laughs> hey, man, we only do what we can, when we can, how we can. Well, listen, man, I'm happy to, uh, to extend this opportunity to you. Um, on Wednesdays, we like to uh, display our entrepreneurs or people in the community doing really cool stuff. And that you are, my friend. Um, I got introduced to you from a common friend named... Um, Mr. Winston G. Lee from Cuffed, and um, he spoke to me highly of this product that you have. And man, when I got a chance to actually touch, feel, see it, I became an instant fr a fan. And then and, and you and I connected, you know, real shortly after, man. So I'm happy to um, have you on the stage right now and um, give you an opportunity to talk to people about this amazing product that you have. So uh First and foremost, please introduce yourself and then we'll get into the, to the product. All right, I am DJ Johnson of the Sylvester Richards Travelers Humidor brand. All right, so for those who don't know, cause you know, I'm fairly new to the game. I, don't, I haven't come into this, to the cigar game, like, you know, acting like a pro. I'm very new to it. You've even shown me some things along the way and I always appreciate you for that. Could you please mm -hmm. explain to the audience what a humidor is? And does. Uh, well, in, in its simplest context, a humidor is just a box, a bag, uh, any type of packaging that you use to preserve the moisture of, of, the, of, of the tobacco, of the cigar itself. You know what I mean? So a humidor is, it has been given a test because you, it's built with wood. People, that's what people know it for. The wood box is made this way. It has cedar wood and all this other stuff. But we live in South Florida and anything can be really used as a humidor because once you get into people who are more uh, avid cigar smokers, you will notice that sometimes they store a bunch of cigars in coolers. A lot of people store, you know, keep cigars in Ziploc bags. They keep cigars in the in the fridge, you know what I mean? So anything can be used as a humidor, but the context of a humidor is just pretty much um, a casing that is used to preserve the humidity of the tobacco, pres preserve the humidity. Right, and that it could also be a room too. So like when you go to cigar shops, yes. you walk into that special room, that, that room's a, humid, a humidor as well, serves as a humidor yes. as well. All right, Correct. Cool, man. So listen, you have something really special that is shaking up the uh, cigar world. Uh, right now with this traveler's humidor, it's not just the fact that you have a traveler's humidor because there are traveling humidors already made and, you know, way before uh, you came up with this, but yours is extremely special. Uh, could you get into uh, what makes your uh, traveling humidor special? Okay. So uh, in a simpler context, what makes this bag, well, sets it apart from the other ones is that it's a backpack. That's just, it's a backpack. It's a box that has been converted into a backpack form. And most humidors that you see, they're, they are boxes. They're bulky. You know what I mean? They're square shaped, rectangle shaped. They have a handle and they're boxes. There's nothing stylish about it. You know what I mean? But it gets the job done. This one here, per se, um, it's a backpack form format. And it comes with an array of different items that, you know, accessories to add on to, to it. It's definitely a lifestyle piece. Um, do you have one that you can open so the audience can see um, all the things that speak to the to the to the cigar smoker, the, the cigar enthusiast lifestyle? All right, most definitely. All right, well, I'm gonna slide this one out the way. We'll get to this one in a bit. This one is actually one of our mini versions, but I actually have one that's already open, sitting right here. Let me know once you can see that. Wow, yeah, we can see it. All right. So briefly, just to go over the things that come that come with it, it comes with an eight ounce flask. You know, uh, pairing items, whatever you choose to drink, you know, your whiskey, your scotches, whether it be vodka, gin, whatever it is, just whatever you deem necessary for your pairing pleasure when, as you smoke a cigar. Next, you will have a, we have a cutter. It comes with a cutter. These, these come standard. Um, this one here particularly is a two-in-one. It has a V-cut and a straight cut. 
The next item is your torch. This one here is a little bit more swanky. I like to say swanky. It's a slim flame. I like this. Um, it's, this is not something, it's not bulky. It's not something you want to just carry around and let people use often. This is one, one that you really want to keep close to you. Uh, next thing is it has a box that holds an additional, up to an additional 20 cigars. Uh, just depending on the size. We, we pretty much have it. It's based on between a six, six by 60 ring gauge. It's pretty much what we use to measure for the, the strap and for the box. So it just depends on what size, what size gauge you prefer to use. Uh, let me go and we'll, just, we'll explain this to you. Up here, you have eight cigars on display and they're held by a leather adjustable strap. So this is adjust. So if you choose to go up into a size 60 ring gauge, the strap can accommodate it. Wow. Now you can go above, you can go above a 60 ring gauge, but you may compromise the slack that you have to also carry a full eight cigars up here. It's held by a leather, a leather shelf just to keep it, you know, saying sturdy and support to make sure they're not moving and shaking all over the place, even though they're strapped in. You have a, you have an additional storage area. This is just a small pouch for additional carrying items. Can you take it up uh, so we can see it? Can you lift it up so we can see that part? Yep. And these items are also removable held by Hidden Madness. So your box, which you have, and your pouch. Nice. So your pouch, you can put anything, your keys, your wallet, um, additional cigar accessories, whatever you deem necessary that's, that could fit into the pouch. Your box, um, again, and a lot of people ask, man, well, how do you keep the bag humidified? We just keep it simple. We use a simple Bovita pack. These also come standard. I give you two with every bag, give you one for your, your box. I also give you one just for the bag, just to maintain some type of moisture and humidity in the bag for your eight, guard, your eight cigars that's on display. So the product is groundbreaking. It's amazing. Um, even for a beginner cigar smoker like myself, I was blown away by it. I grabbed a couple, um, gifted my friend with one because he's the one who brought me into, you know, into the cigar game. Um, but how did you come up with this idea of this traveling humidor with, with, you know, with a flask and all these amazing things? Uh, and, and what was your vision of how a person should use it? Well, um, I had a friend tell me a while ago, uh, if you were, if you really want to be wealthy in this world, man, find a problem and solve it. So I went to my very first cigar event, which was actually the first, the first annual Black Smoke Miami. And I just noticed a lot of people that came to the event were walking around carrying their cigars in Ziploc bags or in little book bags, but they would just stuff them in there. But there was no convenient, hands-free, or even stylish way to just commute with, with you know, an abundance of cigars. So I just, I got to thinking and I started researching and I didn't find anything. So that's when I decided to put together a concept. And I just thought about all the things that I would really like to have when I'm commuting with my cigars. Hence, a flash because you know I always I like to pair my cigars with whiskey. My my, my choice is whiskey. Um, everybody needs a cutter in the torch. I would like to have eight that I can just quickly access, easily accessible. I need eight on display. But let's say I go out of town, I'm on a road trip, or I'm out for a day, or I share a cigar here, you know, here and there with somebody as I'm out. Maybe I may need a few additional sticks. So that's where the box concept came from. And then. Mm -hmm. And then the personal bag for like you, like yeah. you said, your wallet. Hands free. You know? Yeah. When, whenever we're moving, we like to be hands free. So as we move in, we don't like to have our hands occupied. You know, you can only stick so much in your pockets. So if you can carry all your cigars, all your paranoia, and, and have your whiskey and, and still have your hands free and be able to move because it's a back, it's a backpack format, single strap, cross body with an adjustable belt, uh, adjustable hook, latch. Wow. All leather. Yeah. So with that concept, you can always have your hands free as you continue, as you go move around and go about your day. How many different variations of this uh, bag do you have? Uh, currently, there are three. There are three different variations. So the first one is this will be this one here, which is your standard. It comes full flash cutter, torch, eight slot display, box pouch um the second version will be a laptop version now in our laptop version 
you get a flash, you get a mini glass, you get a cutter torch, and you still get your A cigar display. The only difference from that bag comparison to this bag will be that you don't have a box and you don't have the pouch. This area is now converted to storage, um, a sleeve for your laptop. Nice. And, for your, and, you have, and then you have an additional strap for your charger cord. So with the takeaway of the box and the pouch, we give you a glass to go with your flash, still get your cut of torch and your cigars. Nice. So that's that's my entrepreneur version. You know, man, I'm I am as you well, though I'm an entrepreneur. And sometimes I'm moving. I don't need 30 sticks with me. I don't need 15 sticks with me. Eight to do for the day. But I need my laptop because I got plenty of work to do. I love it, man. So, so that suffices for my local dealing. And then the third version would be, I'm gonna slide this one out the way. I actually have one of those right here with me. This will actually be our smaller version. I've actually dealt and came in contact with a lot of women who tend to ask for a smaller version. Do you have something for the women? Well, just to be clear, all the bags are unisex. Yes. So th there's not a man bag or woman bag. They're all unisex, even this smaller version. So this particular bag is roughly about two inches smaller in diameter all the way around. All right. So the changes that we made here is Let's start off with the strap. The strap is a lot slimmer. You get a smaller tote pocket up top where you can store, you know, your wallet keys or anything, you know, something simple. Um, the shoulder mechanism is a little different. We have an adjustable leather strap, but we have two loops. So now with that one, that one is pretty standard. It goes across the left shoulder, but, right, but carries left to right. This one here is interchangeable. You got a single hook, you got two loops. So whether you want to carry left to right, right to left, you want to wrap it around your hip and adjust it. You know, this one here is a lot more versatile. Now, once you open it, same thing, you still have your external hydrometer, which is a functional hydrometer. You have your feet on the bottom, just like with all the other bags. So the bag stands alone. Now, once we open the bag up, then that we cut down the space, it's a few things. So we had to really kind of limit what we do. So you still get your cigars in here. But in here you get six, you get six cigars on display and not and not eight, right? But when you turn it over. Oh wow. You get your flask, you get your glass, you get your cutter, you get your torch, and you get your draw tube. These are my favorite glass. So I, yeah, I put these little glasses in here. They're just nice and classy and good for when you need. It's better than a shot glass, but it's not a big single glass. Right, I like it's it. A it's a tweener. <laughs> it gets it's a the tweener. job done. <laughs> yes. Wow. Listen, how can people get their hands on uh, Sylvester Richard products? Oh, well, right now you can visit, you can actually um, find us on uh, your social media platforms, your, your IG under Sylvester Richards underscore, uh, Facebook, Sylvester Richards, uh, Sylvester Richards LLC. Uh, the website is also www.sylvesterrichards.com. All right. So let me ask um, you, your, your name is BJ. How did you come up with the name Sylvester Richards? Uh, that's actually an interesting concept. Well, my dad actually passed away. It's my dad's first and middle name who passed in in March, in March, April of 2018. That's dope, man. Paying homage to the old man. So I took his first and middle name and kind of just and reversed it. So his name is Richard Sylvester Johnson. I'm Byron James Johnson. So we took Richard Sylvester and then here we have Sylvester Richards. I love it, man. I love it. Hey, listen, my brother. Um, we got to get my promo code going pretty soon, man, because these things going to be flying, man. I believe in the product. Um, I believe in you. Um, like I said, it's an honor and it's a pleasure to have you on today. And um, in closing, I just want to talk, I want you to talk about the event that we both going to be at um, next Thursday, not this Thursday, but next Thursday, um, February the 10th, uh, just before Super Bowl weekend at Lorna's. Right, right, right. So, like PK just said, uh, we have an official launch of the Sylvester Richards brand and Travelers Humidor. And we're going to be, we're also going to be accompanied by some other major brands. The event is taking place February 10th at Lorna's. All right. The event starts at six and ends at 11. 
if you know any of us, reach out to us and we'll get you that we'll get you that code so you can get your tickets. People, let me tell you, do not wait till the last minute. You may not be able to get a ticket. This is a very limited event. So don't wait till the last minute and think you're going to come and get in. This is a very exclusive event. Go ahead and get your ticket. Come out and smoke one with BJ, Papa Key, and, 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 the, and, the, and the rest of the Sylvester Richard family. <laughs> the rest of the <laughs> yes, commission. Definitely the commission. The for commission. sure. Absolutely, man. And this is not just for cigar smokers. These are just, uh, it's an opportunity to mix and mingle. It's a networking event. You know what I mean? Of course, there's going to be cigar smoking there. It's going to be outdoor as well, right outside of uh, Lorna's. There's going to be food served. And uh, we're also going to have some bamboo and villion on deck as well. So Most definitely. I'm looking excited. forward to that. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I'm going to have my flask ready. <laughs> hey, man. Again, guys, this is going to be a very classy event, man. We welcome you all to come out and just partake with us and be part of the family, man. Let them know how they can get in contact with you as well, my brother. Um, you guys can always also reach me through any of the social media platforms that I mentioned. Again, IG is Sylvester Richards underscore, Facebook, Sylvester Richards. Um, the website is www.sylvesterrichards.com. Or you can always reach me at my email list, slyrichardsapparel at gmail.com. Again, that's sly, S-L-Y, Richards, R-I-C-H-A-R-D-S, Apparel, A P P A R E L at gmail.com. That's what's up. Appreciate you, my brother, and we'll get it up, man, hey, man. real soon again. You know what hey, I mean? I appreciate you, Pop, man. Take an opportunity out to just, you know, give me a chance to actually explain and express, you know, the love what I have for what I do and something that I created. You know what I mean? This was my baby. I took something, I took, I took something where there was nothing, you know what I mean? I, and I just appreciate you allowing me to come upon your platform to actually just express and show and showcase this. This is what it's all about, my brother, man. I'm so proud of you. We'll talk soon, okay? Hey, most definitely, my brother. Take care. All right, take care. That's BJ from Sylvester Richards. Um, he gave you all the information. I'm going to run the flyer right now. So if you want to go to the event, check it out.